of Japan. After opening its doors, a push for cultural transformation. Crazy. This is absolutely insane. The revolution washed over the land, making life in the capital exciting and unsettling. You British people. Was swept away by the tide. <gasps> oh my god. Why would he do that? That's so crazy. But for one man, the turbulence of that era was just the beginning of an extraordinary story. Oh my god. Yo, the way courtroom, you're getting arrested. Trial, but why? It'll become clear in time, but for now, you need to concentrate, Ryan Suke. It's about to begin. OMG. Before we begin, there is one point of order I would like to confirm. Yesterday evening, the defense made a last minute request for a change bed. That's correct. I made the request. It's, uh, normal people don't exist. Uh, who is, who's gonna be the person? He needs to answer quickly. What should you do? Wait. Kazuma's lawyer here. I can't defend myself. I am defending me because I'm too cool to be defended by someone else. You'll be what? I can't read. Please help. Oh, yeah, I'm cool enough not to be defended. Well, let's go. I'm going to jail. Right now. It's uh, no doubt where the Supreme Court J J J J Japan J J J uh, I can't read. He's questioning your ability to do the job. You can't be questioning more than I am. It's a little stuff with very simple questions. Are you hearing me? Yes. Yes. Can't sit before the court the name of the victim in this case. Um, it's me. You have to press E. E. E for E. Yeah, I don't care. I'm Ill I'm the murderer man. Yo, let's go. Oh, that's not me. I can't read. Don't tell me to read. It's this guy's Wilson. From her look, Shulm. Uh, well, at least you can remember the uh, Dr. Wilson was visiting Paris, England, from the, to go to university. Indeed, uh, because he's English, he is more epic than you, even though he's not, because British people are cringe. Murdering a professor is illegal. Ugh, but I, I did do it. The fact is, I wasn't there at all. Because it's not a sound like these. Is you mean you looking at your body and burner? I don't remember my damn. Wait. That's not how I speak. I'm this professor medicine. Dr. John H. Wilson loses life. Well, I know the real cause of death, but why have to give them a fake? I d no. R. so-called photographic print of the scene of the crime 
And as you can see, there's a bullet hole there. He was shot with a gun. Hmm. Oh, uh, of course. I don't understand one thing you were saying. Ahem, ahem. Um, are you alright? You seem to be coughing up some air. Uh, uh, the, uh, yeah, some uh, cherry juice. Understood, Osanaga san. Will you kindly tell the court everything you can about the incident? Oh, yeah, yeah, give me the one, sir. I found the victim, an English gentleman, slumped in his chair, standing immediately beside him. Good night, was the case he invested in. Yes, hold on. Uh, let me just clarify something here. Uh, well, you pick up a gun that I found lying on the floor beside the professor. I didn't, I didn't shoot him. No, no, no. <laughs> that's just that's just not right. What did you just say? I can't even forget that you said what you say, my guy. Hey, there's a woman. Oh my God, there is a woman. Well, you're clearly a very. How do you say that word, waiter? The prosecution has decisive evidence from sworn witnesses who were present at the scene of the crime. What the heck? The defense. <laughs> Kesema has died in the middle of a court case. We are all very sad to hear that. Guys. Yes, sir. The great Nippon Imperial Army Sergeant. Uh, yes, sir. No, sir. Reporting for duty, sir. Myself. I find him. I find employ as a purveyor of fine articles of antiquity from and conduct my trade. From Rasate, a humble premises in the section district. Kirio Kurekuda at your service. An antique dealer and a soldier. What an unusual pairing. Both of these gentlemen were, um, uh, we could say, as we'd say, present at the restaurant on the day of question. The witnesses saw. I was investigating a regulation beefsteak at the restaurant while having a tactical discussion with the old man. Myself, I was extolling the virtues of a particularly fine golden curio to the military gentleman. At the precise moment, a firearm was discharged. I observed the enemy's actions with my own eyes. The black uniformed varsity cadet fired on the English civilian, and from the back, the cowardly little weasel. I was on my hands and knees, investigating where about the mis of my mysteriously absconded pre precious curio. But, but, this is ridiculous. I didn't shoot anyone. It's not really true, right? It's not really true, right? Yeah. Yes, all I did was pick up the gun I saw lying on the ground because that was the smartest thing I could do ever. That's exactly. That's the only thing I got from the sentence. We know. Clear the verdict of yes. Yo, what in the name of the emperor is the meaning of this outburst? I am Erm, um, I mean the defense is, demands its right to a cross-examination. I'm gonna press. 
Um, uh, why, why aren't you saying anything? Is this some new interrogation technique? I hadn't actually thought of what I wanted to ask. Just ask about. <laughs> Alright then, the uh, um, what did you just say? Okay. <laughs> this beefsteak you mentioned. What kind of food is that? Danger? Beefsteak. Beefsteak is a delicious cut of veal, vigorously cooked on a cast iron grill. And served piping hot. Oh, if food could receive medals of honor, beef steak would be almost as highly decorated as a cutlet. Right, I see. Um, thank you. Uh, so next question. This cutlet you mentioned. What kind of food is that? Tension. Cutlet is a delicious cut of veal tossed in breadcrumbs and deep fried in cooking oil. Accept your guilty verdict, atone for your crimes, and when you're released from prison, try it! Yes, sir, I will, sir, on the double, sir. Sir, Andrew. I don't Okay, I'm so sorry, I'm doing my best. So, next question. Is it just me, or do you keep hearing a sort of wah crying in the background? Negative. Well, at least we've learned that he's a big beef lover. <laughs> it's not easy knowing what questions to ask. So, oh, I have no idea what you're talking about. A Koban, boy. A Koban? You mean an old Edo coin? The day prior to the incident, a treasure of exceptional value from the Hoi period entered my possession. I took myself to the restaurant the following day and said item Greeted in my bosom pocket in the hope of an, anf of an affluent, cognizant, appraised of its indisputable value being present. So you were hoping to sell your Koban coin to Sergeant Nosa, who you, whom you met at the restaurant. Yes, yes, it's quite clear where you're going with this boy. You were about to assert that a any less soldier would no, have no hope of purchasing a precious Koban. Isn't that so? Um, well. You little absurd cadet. You wanna add disrespecting a superior officer to your list of crimes? Do you? Blatant subordination. No, no. I, I didn't say anything, although Pennyless might be just the word I was looking for. In any case, in any case, the hour was already advanced beyond that of the midday luncheon. There remained precious few present with whom I could engage in discourse about matters of business. The gentleman aside me who is grappling with his praise feel at the time was my sole prospect. I see. At that precise moment, a firearm was discharged. Yes. So you're saying you actually saw me at the time? Affir Affirmative! I saw you laughing, cackling like a madman as you trained the barrel of your gun on the English civilian. I'm changing his voice, I don't like it. <laughs> 
but that's impossible. I I only. Allow me to come visit on flight, please. Sorry, private. Sorry, private. Thank you. <laughs> and so, what if it was? Arc and double arc. My six cents. Sorry, my six cents of danger. I picked up the waves of murderous energy radiating from your foul mind, which means a split second before you pulled the trigger, I was looking right at you, cadet. Surely that's certainly that's hardly possible. Is it? Why has his voice just suddenly changed like five billion times? Do you think I'd have got where I am today in the army if I, if I couldn't sense danger in the air, son? Why does his voice keep changing? <laughs> the Bible. You. <gasps> oh my god. What what are you playing at, Cadet? What is the meaning of this subordination? So I'm just gonna read all of them in my normal voice in inconsistency, see, sir. I mean yes. There's a clear inconsistency here. It's quite nonsense. How can, what can this print possibly tell us that we don't already know? Well, obviously, that, um, I know what I want to say, but the words just won't come out of my mouth. Hmm, I think this proves beyond any any doubt that there is no place for an amateur student here in this grand courtroom. Hmm. Arg, this is so frustrating. Oh, please. Surely this doesn't require an explanation. It could be more plain. Spell it out would be an insult to the court. Kazuma, what? What are you talking about? It's apparent from a single glass set, the photographic print presented by this evidence, that there's a clear discrepancy here with the surgeon's statement. What? Surgeon, uh, yes sir, no sir. Yes sir, what's, yes sir, what's sir? Statement you just made was this. Black uniform varsity cadet fired on the English civilian. And from the back, cowardly little weasel. Yes, affirmative, sir. But no, this is happy.
I forgot to unmute my mic. If what you see is true, then there's something going on with your behind the scenes. And now is your chance to expose it and to draw the truth in your cross-examination. I, I don't know because they left. The defense is entitled to cross-examine the witnesses, but make it quick understood. Yo. For the more visual search of the premises of the Okay, so I've already read this. Sound of the firearm rang in my ears on the very next moment. I saw you waving the gun at the Englishman. Yes, pointing the gun at the foreign man, he was that well, young lad in black. That much uh, myself, I did see. Yes, it may be true that I was holding the gun at that point in time, but I did not shoot it. I, I picked it off the floor because that's the only reasonable thing to do, really. I just finished drinking my coffee and I was about to leave the restaurant when I found the gun and that was a big brain moment. Bang. Gunshot. Gun. Sorry, what do you mean I can't hear from the gun? Because I'm deaf from the gun. It's conversely, I failed to pick up the caban on the floor. Anyway, the fact remains myself, I did see you with pistol in hand standing over the foreigner. Furthermore, if visual search of the premise to at a time. Confirmed that we were the only personal prison. Yes. It's you have been at pains to point out time and time again. I'm I feel I'm growing a callus in my ear, and yet no one else appears to have even caught a glimpse of the woman. Arg. There's more people at the dining at the time than someone else would notice sir. Fortunately, it was already past 2 p.m. when it happened, the quiet time between lunch and dinner in any restaurant. I know, of course, the place is almost empty, it was what you expect. Certainly 2 p.m. is neither here nor there in terms of a time to eat. I wonder if there was a reason why the victim was eating at the time of the area why he was alone. Yes, Your Excellency, there was indeed a reason there was. Okay. Medical report card. The 19th November near past one. Hmm, the very day of the incident. So the victim went for a late launch following his appointment. The explanation could be more simple. The prosecution felt no need to submit evidence before as it really has no bearing on the scale. <gasps> no way. It opens. Direction of molar with topical anesthesia. Direction of molar? You mean he had a tooth taken out? Seems so for the incident he had a bad tooth removed. Perhaps they use laughing gas. That's the most modern practice for the West pain relief. Yes, I forget this. Anesthesia. 
Although it's hard to believe there's anything that can actually stop you feeling pain. Either it's a cautionary note from the way that couple practitioners will strictly clean no food or drink besides water for th three hours post procedure unless anesthetic effects have passed. Really? No. Uh, um, uh, well, yeah, I think, uh, or, uh, what are you, whatever, 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 I wish I could, but first and foremost here, I'm the accused. Where's, uh, Ryu, Ryu no Everyone stumbles on their words occasionally under the circumstances. I wouldn't worry about things, Kazuma. Let's get, I wouldn't raise hands straight up, you know what you want to say. Don't choose words, just say you're dumb. You are stupid. It, he had to go to doctor, he have no tooth, no more teeth, cannot eat for three hours until they grow back. So there must be someone else eating with him. Do you really believe that? What? What's up, birds? Of course I believe it. How could it possibly be relevant? Perhaps I have a clinic, which is it's a dental clinic. Dental clinics are supposed to mean something to me. Perhaps if I told you that it just had a tooth extracted. And furthermore... The victim has been forbidden from eating. <gasps> It orders not to eat, so what? It's all written up in here. No further drink other than water for three hours. Post procedure while anesthesia by yourself. What? No, that, that. Can't. Good, good as sound. What boy? What? As you just heard, when he was killed, sometime shortly after 2 p.m., the victim couldn't have been eating anything at all. No. Additionally, there's more. You have assured the court with the summer. The victim was dining alone. But that cannot possibly be the case. Because I said so, and I'm the most coolest person ever. Me! Let's go! Yes. I was eating a steak. You are insane. Go to the... You are the Joker. Go to the... Mental hospital. <laughs> I really like Rensuke. This is Brian. Next time you make a quip like that, I'll make you eat your words. And you'll be needing some dental surgery yourself. Oh. oh. Chill out, my guy. Sheesh. Sheesh. Uh, that, that one. <laughs> Obviously, it could have been uh, someone else. It can only have been someone else. What if he just didn't obey the order and he was just like, I'm hungry, I'm gonna eat steak. There it was, because I saw her. Therefore, the illogical conclusion is that he disobeyed the orders. <laughs> we have strong evidence to support our assertion. It's clear that his testimonies are unreliable. Sus decides to push through a ruling at the stage. We will lodge a formal complaint with the Ministry of Justice relentlessly. Tesma, are you insane? That's what I've been saying this whole time. They are insane. Shut up. Let's jump. Chief Inspector! Oh my god! What the heck are I have no idea, but let's face it, the police have a lot of power.
Osinoka Sandman Sands. Well, it's direct to carry out all investigations flawlessly to my kind. What when I? I was distracted. I was unusually careless. So you mean to say, you really are a detective? Yeah, man. No cap, my guy. What the heck are uh, this bussin? Salary must be terrible. <laughs> Yo. He is paid mi below minimum wage. There have been a series of <sighs> kind of incidents. Murders! However, hmm. Of course, I am the murderer. Mission. There is another person who is indeed true. However, you are lying. Would that be correct? Ahem, ahem. I'm dying, not lying. Correct. Unbelievable. As I suspected, you are sus. You were the imposter all along. Bang! Oh my god, who just shot them? As soon as I heard the gunshot, I ran out of the kitchen to see what had happened. The victim sat slumped in his chair beside him, gun in hand. It's so. so the, uh, is it, uh, the victim? There was uh, an English woman. So the truth comes out. I immediately sealed off the restaurant and reported the incident or to the bureau. What well, it was then that I received some special orders. Special orders? You mean to say remove the woman English scene? It was clear that the English woman's presence at the restaurant was to be concealed. Those were my orders. But but what if this English woman was the killer? Yeah, I think it would be in everyone's best interest not to pursue that idea. The Empire of these, uh, the friendly turns. Because, because the English man is dead on our soil without irrefutable evidence that would be completely out of the question because I'm just making stuff up because I can so that's the reason for the disappearance of this phantom of the woman case but that's not right it's sus <gasps> Kazma He's going to say you're sus. One possibility does spring to mind. What do you mean, Kazma? University is currently hosting a number of exchange students from Great Britain, and I'm fairly, fairly certain one of them is studying there. Is a young English woman. What? You're a sus man. You're kind of sus, actually, guys. You're a shoot man. Uh... I can see why the leader is the chosen candidate for the OVC study. You mean, when I removed the woman from the scene of the crime, I thought it prudent to check her identity first. Or... Yo. Okay, was this written? Okay, guys. Um, so, but we're gonna find out tomorrow what her name is. Boom. Case closed.